My name is Tom, I work for HTC, I'm part of the training team. Uh, I'm going to show you uh, a couple of our phones. First one being the HTC One S. So, we've got two different versions of the wireless here. Uh, they're, they're the same inside, you know, for all intents and purposes. But we use a different uh, aluminium uh, one-piece body. So, this one's um, uh, uh, anodized aluminium, uh, but it, it's graduated, so you can see the color difference on there. So it makes it much tougher than the regular aluminium. We do that with all of us. And then this one over here is, this is a little bit special. So we've got this kind of matte black finish, yeah. uh, and the way we achieve that is called micro arc oxi oxidation. Um, and what we do, we actually put it in a, in a, a plasma bath and put over 10,000 volts to it, and it actually changes the molecular structure, it changes the molecular structure of the actual metal, and makes it into a ceramic. So the outside is a ceramic and it's five times tougher than anodized aluminium. You can even do to kind of scrape it, but I'm not. I'm just leaving a bit of my nail yeah. on the uh, on the phone. Just leave your nail <laughs> on the phone. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, so I'll show you some software features. Okay. okay. So the things like um, you know it, it's the one series. So we try to make some features throughout. Things like um, you know simple design. You know. Uh, rather than having a grill, we've got um, uh, micro-drilled holes, you know, just to be, have that simplicity. We've also then got a great camera on here, so it's 8 megapixel, it's got an f2.0 uh, lens, 28mm uh, wide-angle lens, and it's um, uh, got a backlit sensor. So, real world, it's all about taking the right photo at the right time and quick enough. So, 0.7 seconds, you're into the camera and you can take a photo, and then if I tilt it up a little bit, uh, I can take a shot, great. But if you can hear that, I'm taking a shot every 0.2 seconds. And I can take up to 99 shots, and you can just spin through, you know. That's really cool. So you can decide the one you want. If you, you, were, you can make a stop motion with it. Absolutely, absolutely. Um, you can um, uh, press best shots, and if you were following a, a moving, uh, something moving, for, you know, if you're tracking it, it would take the one, it would take the shot with the uh, least amount of camera blur, uh, you know, for movement and stuff. So, if you can do that, that's great. Uh, we've also got some other things. You notice video and camera are no longer separate applications. Uh -huh. uh, so I can press on video, and we're videoing in 1080p, but I can also take photos. We don't get the camera noise, because uh, that would annoy the video, you know, we're getting in the way. But I can also go into that, uh, go into that video, you know, and I've got the, the video, and also the photos I was taking in. I can go into the video, play it, full 1080p, I can also take shots from inside the video. Wow, I can pause cool. it, and I can go frame by frame. You know, Excellent. To see, oh, this is exactly uh, what I And take a snapshot uh, with the side of the video? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Uh, no, it'll be, uh, yeah, on yeah. the or, or, or HD size. It would be the resolution that you recorded the video in. Okay. Uh, so that's all good, you know, some nice little fixes. We also have things like HDR, which is great, so it'll take three different exposures and mix them up so you don't get, you know, your friend a silhouette and the mountain view behind, beautiful. Um, you know, you can actually get that right. We also have slow motion video record. So I can record video and if I do something like crazy, you know, um, and I can pause it. Or I'll stop it recording, go in here, and I can play it back, and it's full 1080p. Uh, so I can play it at normal speed, or half speed. Oh. Just for a little bit of fun. Yeah. How many frame rate are there? So it's recording at 60, okay. so that then you can play back at 30. Uh, obviously you can mess around with the, the, you know, you can edit it, and do cool crazy stuff. So we've got that kind of cool, cool little feature on there with regards to the camera. Um, we've also got things like a music hub now. Mm -hmm. So you can have all your music things in one place. Uh, Beats is a, one of our strategic partners, you know, and you can now have Beats do everything. So on the last generation, it was great. Do our music player uh, and our video player. It can now be for games, online radio, and we've got TuneIn uh, tune radio in, seven digital for downloading things. And if you added something like Spotify, it would just automatically go in here. Something a bit more obscure, you could go and add it into your music hub. Uh, and you know, the kind of functionality that gives us drawing it all in, so I can do things like 
have car mode. So car mode, if we were outside and we had GPS and everything, this would just show you the map and of you, where you were driving, your local area, um, and it would show you the traffic. The idea being, when you're driving and you know where you're going, you don't need to sat now, but you do want to know if there's a traffic jam. So that will do that, and that's great. But I can also flip around navigation, both our own and Google's. You can flip around to your contact list. Uh, you know, just nice and easy. Home will now take us back to here. On the other side, we have music and we have online radio. Perfect. Radio. Uh, and we have a crack and it will, uh, will take us out. That is it, exclusive uh, on this phone? or yeah, uh, No, it's across all of the one series phones. Okay, with a sense uh, 4.0. Absolutely. Yes. Okay. 100%. Awesome. Awesome. Really awesome. Thank you very much.